Big corner. Oh, that's a great ball. It's the luck of the camera. Wow. Crowd goes crazy. Everyone's on their feet. The scenes. Pat's going crazy. He loves it. <laughs> What's going on, Team Tweet? I hope you're all super well. I'm heading off today to go and watch... Where are my keys? Mm, that's no good. I'm going to go and watch Manly United versus Harkoa. Look, I'll spill the beans now. Both these teams I've trialed for. Maybe we can talk more about the team you guys haven't heard about in the future. But anyway, going to go and watch this game because Pat invited me down. And I thought, why on earth would I not go? You know, he's going to hook me up with some free tickets. I'm going to go down, enjoy some footy. I know Finno will also be there. I'm not sure who else you guys know. But I used to play at Manly from under 16s up until my last year of eligibility for the under 20s. And then obviously went off overseas after that last year. Do I regret it? No, I don't think so. I loved my experience overseas, but at the same time, I see a lot of players who have stayed on and it's not just at Manly who have now gone on and progressed into the first team. So it's a difficult call, but hey, you, you always are happy where you are right now. Never look back on the past. So let's get down there. Let's go see Paddy. Let's watch a bit of this game. There's the warm up for the first team. Get a bit more of that soon. Here's the man, Paddy. You good, mate? Oh, look at this free pass. Look at that. How you going, mate? Good to see you. What's up? Not much. Now, before we get into the footage, this video is sponsored by our friends over at One Football. Guys, I literally wake up with this app every single morning. If you guys want to download it, the link for it will be down in the description. Click on that, completely free to download. Check the fixtures, results. Transfer window is coming up, uh, not too soon. But eventually it will, and you don't want to miss out on all the rumors. So click the link in the description to download One Football. Let's get on with the footage. <laughs> Focus. It's good football, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Except that. That's what we do. That's a great ball game. Oh, wow. Jeez, was he off? Oh, no, I don't know, I didn't think so. Down there. That ain't a tuck here. <laughs> Into the middle. Out wide again. This is what I like about that. Oh, I was just going to say that when they win it, they keep it. Mind you, they do. It's strange. <laughs> oh, I love that from a centre back. Ooh. Ooh, that was close. Ooh. I wasn't even filming that, sorry guys. Whoops. Wow. Ooh. 
What's up? 46th minute. Oh, can I get a break? Where was it? Round here. Guy had... Keep... Defender had tried to head it back, alright? No. Head it back to the keeper. Guy intercepted it over the keeper. Goal. It wasn't an option to head it back. Goal of City City East FC to number 24. Wow. Crowd, crowd's going off, mate. Score is... <laughs> one now. That's... Two minutes in, that's rough. Big corner. Oh, that's a great ball. It's a rock of the camera. Wow. The crowd goes crazy. Everyone's on their feet. The scenes. Pat's going crazy. He loves it. Wow. One, one all. And we're in the... Getting close to the 60th minute. Look at him, everyone loves it. And he's been replaced by number 12, Charles Mindy. All right, let's see. Eight <laughs> one. No, nothing. Wow, counter. Wow. Big space. So Paddy is a very happy man, it, you can tell that guy, he's been through so much, he hasn't played in so long, he, he, he actually ran, he told me before, 36.2 kilometers an hour, my fastest is 34, he is, he's lightning man. And that was while he was coming back from injury, but anyway, he has the passion and he loves it and loves the club, and he's not even playing, that's what's so brilliant. It frustrates him because he wants to be out there as well, but hey, they got the result. And man, the qual it's good quality football, watching the game, it's, you know, it's up and back, but both teams keep possession, they like to keep the ball, and that's what I like about it. Is there a huge difference between MPL 2 and MPL 1? If I had to be honest, in the under 20s, there is a big difference when I watch them. I watch the live stream as well, and they keep the ball a lot more in MPL 1. Just the touch, the passes, they, they want to keep possession of it. In the first grade, I would say there's a lot more long ball in MPL 2, whereas here it's almost like when they've done the long ball or they've looked for that opportunity, they really look to play out. And I would say that's the biggest difference between the MPL 1 and the MPL 2. But apart from that, yeah, I would say better players. That's just <laughs> normal. MPL 1, why wouldn't there be better players than MPL 2? It's not super huge, but there's definitely a difference there. And, you know, I've trained with MPL 1, so and there definitely is a difference. But that's why I would say in terms of style of play, it's the possession. They like to keep the ball a lot more in MPL 1. So interesting. Good little bit of learning there, watching a few players and you know just picking up on little things. Always an opportunity to learn, but also good to see Pat too. So gonna head home now. Not sure what I'm gonna do for the rest of the day, but yeah, good little outing. Right, so finally I finished on this bit of paper magical. 
I finished my sort of game analysis of the game on Saturday, so yesterday's match. I don't know why that took me so long to process, but I managed to catch the last little bit of the Arsenal-Leicester game. I got Sam on the phone is filling me in with kind of what's been going on because he's watched the whole thing. I watched probably the first 15 minutes and was like, all right, I need to focus on my own self. I need to analyze my game. It's more important. Plus, I needed to do it for the video as well, but managed to catch this last little bit. I learned a lot watching that playing as a number 10 there were so many different things that I look back on and go okay I, that can so easily be fixed oh my Leicester Leicester just scored 2-0 ah <sighs> Jamie Vardy oh dear there's a few things there where I can go that that's a mistake but 100% next week fixed that's a mistake next week fixed and then there's also so many things here where I go brilliant brilliant quality good like it that it's just it's i'm excited so that's my game analysis done i'm gonna sit through this last five minutes far out <sighs> arsenal man okay super disappointing result with arsenal but i got something kind of exciting so as you guys know i used to do the whole smoothie i think it went up to 1139 calories at one point and i would have it at night time and then it became incredibly hard when i was trialing all the time to have it consistently so i haven't had that thousand calorie smoothie in such a long time and one of the big things that it i would say probably the biggest thing holding me back from taking myself to the next level is my weight, is my strength. They're combined. So I'm sitting here going, oh, I'm kind of hungry, what, what can I eat? Oh, you know what, I have a smoothie. And I went, you know what? What if I had my smoothie for breakfast? What if I exchanged my um, five, 600 calories of wheat bix in the morning and instead I had my 1,100 calorie smoothie for breakfast, man. I think that's the way to go. More food and the things in that smoothie are incredible. So I think it's only going to benefit me. I did a little bit of research and this sort of time, if I'm still hungry, I can have two pieces of toast with cottage cheese on top and then this other sort of protein powder that I can have as well. So that's the way I'm gonna go about it. I need to be more disciplined with my eating, my weight lifting when I'm not sick. It's good, so I'm excited. I'm very excited for that. I think maybe this could be a big turn and we'll see. But for now, Team Tweet, I'm signing out. Make sure you like on the show. Subscribe now and enjoy the journey. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.